in today's class we are going to learn how can we uh, check the data of the inventory which are still we are going to check the data of the inventory which is available in our store okay for this you are going to execute the transaction code mb52 and i am just going to check the data uh, in our plant using material type okay my main objective is to check the data which is available in our store is third party sales material how many materials of this category is available in our store in whole plant so we are going to execute uh, fill the plant code fill the material type and uh, you just execute the data no data is available i am just going to execute the transaction code jtcs telecom space so whenever you want to search the material in our warehouse stock then you need to uh, use this transaction code okay so see the material is uh, available in our uh, store and storage location for example this material data card uh, nic pcm cia is available at our 2026 storage location so you can check it out okay and the stock which is available in the unrestricted stock is available for your use okay another one is check the data using uh, transaction code is mb 5t so using mb 5t you can get the data which are in the transit in the transit so i am again going to execute the transaction code see so using uh, transaction code mb5t in the transit transfer table in the uh, you will get the data which is which is in the transit mode okay so you can uh, filter out this data as per your requirement and you will get all the details okay in mb 5t you will get the data which is in the transit what is the meaning of the transit that uh, data which is either is not available at source end trans transmitting end and not at the receiver end means it is in between okay so either sending plant uh, will cancel the good issue document then it's available at the sending plant store either uh, the receiving plant will receive the data uh, receive the material as per the gi document of the sending plant so it's available at your receiving plant store so this is the way how you can check the data and third one is the mb51 this transaction code is also very important uh, here you can check the material movement history in plant code uh, 3002 storage location 1000 for example I just want to good receipt so for the good receipt against the purchase order using movement type 101 and uh, from posting date 1st January 2018 to 31st March 2018 what is the what are the inventories which we have purchased against the purchase order from the vendor external vendor so here you can get the data in uh, respective mode okay 
click on the flat list layout so you will give, you will see all the details see these are the material these are the plant these are the storage these are the store uh, material document posting date the quantity which is purchased document amount and uh, these are the purchase orders hope you understand so these are the uh, material which we have purchased again these purchase order for our requirement so if you want to find out the data as per your requirement then you can find out for example i just want to consume the inventory which uh, in project so in the uh, our plant 3002 storage location 1000 and the movement type is 281 what is the movement type is to on the basis of the movement type you can find out the your material movement history 101 is good gr good receipt against the purchase order 102 is good receipt for po reversal and 201 is the direct consumption of the stuff so what 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 is meaning of the 281 281 is a good issue for network good issue in the wbs good issue in the project final moment in between this period i went to check the material which are consumed in project so i'm just going to execute the transaction code system will just nothing is available for the consumption so i'm going to uh, pick out the date of 2020 if any material is available for consumption only one moment is available five quantities uh, consume in uh, network and using this material document you can uh, you can double click on this material document system will generate system will give you all the details okay and also you can check this history only five quantity of amount this is consumed in the project against movement type 281 in this plant in this period so here we have discussed the three transaction code first one is the mb52 mb52 will give you give you the warehouse stock report which is available in your warehouse or in your storage location in the given plant mb5 t mb5 t will you give you the idea regarding the stock in the transit how, how much amount of the stock which are going to receive in the future from the one plant to another plant and how much amount of the stock which uh, we have already supplied to the uh, another plant but they are not still received the data uh, material so and in mb51 we have checked the material movement history how much amount of the material we have purchased against the purchase order how much i have consumed in the project how much i have consumed in uh, maintenance activity how much what is the material which i have directly consume again cost center using movement type 201 so this is the way how you can identify uh, the inventory management in your plant okay please share this tutorial with your friends and colleagues because we have made the tutorial for your knowledge purpose your knowledge sharing purpose okay and uh, i respect all your valuable comment and feedback and suggestion in your comment section i respectfully reply possible reply possible answer for your query and if you are new in our youtube channel erp sap team then please subscribe our youtube channel for latest updates don't forget to press the bell icon and uh, if you think this is useful tutorial for you then please press the like button and it will support and help us boost our motivation level okay and don't forget to share this okay with your colleagues and friends because knowledge sharing is gaining okay thank you have a nice day see you in the next tutorial